Wrapping up 2019, South Korea's Minister of Unification spoke to reporters about his thoughts on the past year, mainly regarding the North Korea-U.S. negotiations and ties between the two Koreas themselves. He said there needs to be a tentative agreement between Pyongyang and Washington to make sure their dialogue continues. Oh Jung-hee has this report. As 2019 draws to a close without any progress in denuclearization talks between North Korea and the United States, South Korea's unification minister has suggested reaching a tentative agreement. Speaking to reporters on Thursday, Kim yeon chul proposed to prevent the situation from worsening and to restore momentum. We need the wisdom of modus vivendi, a tentative agreement as a stepping stone to a final agreement. By modus vivendi, he means Pyongyang and Washington should first reach an agreement on what they can to keep the dialogue momentum going through what could be a grueling negotiation process. And while inter-Korean relations are deadlocked, Minister Kim said Seoul hopes to expand areas of cooperation with Pyongyang and ensure that cooperation leads the denuclearization process on the Korean peninsula next year. Regarding the rail and road connection projects the two Koreas worked hard on last year, Kim said, The government is paying attention to the draft resolution. China and Russia submitted to the UN Security Council. South and North Korea did a joint study on railways and roads in the North last year. We are preparing to arrange a basic plan with the North and see that through. Another plan is to conduct joint studies with the North on the ecology of the demilitarized zone. However, since it'll take time to start that with the North, South Korea first plans to research the areas south of the border in 2020. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.